Hello. Good day, everyone. Welcome to my presentation. My name is Vincent Balogun. I am the Deputy Vice Chancellor of Academic at the State University of Nigeria. In the State, Nigeria. I will take you through, I will take you through uh, the topic titled Achieving a Green University in the Post Pandemic Era. In this presentation, we're looking at a few things. Um, looking at the introduction, uh, paradigm shift, the learning workflow strategy, greenness, uh, post pandemic era of our university, and what you have adopted as a learning management system model, and then we'll wrap it up. The complexity and the management. The animosity of our world has indicated that a lot of things have to um, change, um, particularly in the COVID 19 era, where many international institutions within Africa did not perceive the need to adopt and invest in ICT. So, this has opened up you know, a very big challenge because we are not anticipating that our unpreparedness for this paradigm shift. That's exactly what the COVID-19 era brought about. So it calls on all of us, particularly in Africa, to look at how we can align ourselves with ICT um, available and learning management system resources. Of course, as we know, the 20th century education is more of compliance and it's more of conformity. However, the 21st century education Deviated from that and brought about the skills model where the education system now involves the acquisition of skills, now involves the acquisition of uh, competencies, transferable skills, and competencies. That's particularly what we at the Dostage University uh, with Array have been up and running. And this unexpected rate of change. Uh, that has become very necessary for universities good right to respond to and they need to adapt um, to this sudden change uh, for us to be able um, to think about the learning um, requirement, learning, learning criteria for our skills and for our ever growing population. These transferable skills can be acquired in few basic steps that those state universities are have considered and called the education um, sheet. And those four criteria involves critical thinking, forward thinking, deep learning, and rigorous academic content. That's what those state universities are way as far as a solution to this changing and so these four critical uh, areas has evolved at our university and has created innovative students that are ready to take the challenge of the 21st century. Because we know that the 21st century is for knowledge production. It is once said, according to Sir Ken Robinson, that the world is dynamic, the more complex the world becomes, the more creative and research driven we need to be to meet its challenges. And that's why institutions now need to be more innovative, to be more creative, to be successful. Um, why ideas of success has changed, the education system, especially in Africa, has not always adjusted to its method or goals to be the change. The university as a whole of learning and transformation is required for skills, knowledge, and attributes. And so for any university to transform into a green university, it is important that that university followed our proposed teaching and learning workflow strategy. Now, in this teaching and learning workflow strategy, we consider the three R uh, green university model for redirecting, for re-imaging, and for research. This redirect, re image, and reset everything about 
critical thinking, about forward thinking, about deep learning and rigorous academic development. So when COVID-19 came, it brought about so many challenges. And among the challenges is that education system now, now begin a new phase where the new normal has been redefined. That new normal has empowered us to develop and propose the workflow um, strategy that we adopted at the Blue State University. The first part of it is looking at the academic institutions. Then we collate all curriculum, hand them over to teachers or lecturers. We study it, prepare their lectures. Everything is done seamlessly online with a management system. We brought in our industrial collaborators. Our, we check the quality assurance, and then everything goes into the student teaching and learning modes. And then students are prepared for the examination, which are also done online. We got feedback, and then we ensure that they have the KSA, the knowledge skills and attitude required uh, for the learning. Now, all these were made possible by the uh, evolution of the Canvas Learning Management System that Edo State University that we adopted and that we first did after that. So in Edo State University that we, we have commitment to developing it as two uninterrupted academic program, quality teaching and research with a strong understanding of the role of sustainability in the So Edo State University that we was established in 2016, committed to its vision of being center of excellence in quality teaching, research and innovation. Prior to COVID-19 pandemic era, we launched Canvas Learning Management System, which enhances our teaching and learning effort for us to develop you know, into the workflow. Uh, as you can see, that is the Green University, Edo State University area view, where we have everything planned and, and, and well laid out structures. Um, that's our world-class sporting facility, where again everything is well laid. That's our media, our multimedia uh, conducive environment for teaching and learning. This is uh, a sample of all our lectures. Now, the 21st century education for sustainable development has brought about how to live today, and so that we will not affect our future for living. Okay, for achieving their own. Purpose. So the for sustainable development emphasizes future thinking, strategic planning that will enable leaders to help create and flourish in a more economic world. Now, for us to be able to succeed in achieving a green university, ICT in education is very important, which was embedded, setting an infrastructure and is also embedded. Now, our greenness uh, post-pandemic era involves input, process, output, and feedback. So there are our model, which is the learning management system model, what you can see. The learning management system um, model we conduct our practical online using equipment such as an automatic. We also an automatic is for medical students. We also have our academic information system, which is also embedded into the learning management system, to be able to manage student information manage um, certificate, manage transcript, manage examination, manage results. Now, a simple uh, technology, which we call TED, uh, Technology Enhanced Learning, uh, has empowered and enabled us to be able to manage all of this in one go. Um, that's a typical example of our student learning uh, during the COVID-19 era, then at uh, home during the COVID-19 era. And in that era, we were able to manage the resources, reduce waste, and then we were able to uh, recover quite a lot of waste resources that have been uh, used. Practical classes were done uh, using simulation software rather than physical. Uh, we use alternatives to practical. We have video recordings available. Uh, all these were made by the learning management system. Now, if any university want to evolve as a green university, particularly in Africa, we advise that they adapt the 
a dual state to vegetarian model. And in that model, our lecturers are engaged uh, actively. Uh, student graduate as a prevent due, there will be no strike, there will be no uh, any natural uh, disaster or anything that happened whatsoever. Students will always learn at the comfort of their own. Academic calendars are unaltered. There's real time lab practical. Current uh, students and lecturers interact actively and well. Uh, and this also has empowered parents uh, to be able to monitor their work. So it's a wake up call continent to make sure that universities turn green. Universities are really become a model for the 21st century in the era of COVID 19 pandemic. As a result of digital transformation of the modes of the management of its educational system. So, to ensure global competitiveness in building a green and sustainable university, we propose that universities around the world and across the world adopt our model, a dual state learning management system model that will ensure that we deliver teaching and we deliver learning to the greenness of the SDG. Thank you for listening. Thank you very much.